North Carolina's rivers are full of dinnertime favorites like trout and catfish, but a new study shows that most locally caught fish are full of toxic chemicals. WREL climate change reporter Liz McLaughlin explains. Freshwater fish caught in rivers and lakes across the nation contain dangerous levels of so-called forever chemicals, according to a new analysis of data from the Environmental Protection Agency. The study found nearly all fish samples contained alarming concentrations of PFOS, a synthetic toxin linked to a number of health risks. They're linked to um, several different types of cancer in humans based on human studies. They can impact your liver, they can impact your kidneys. The federal drinking water health advisory for that chemical is 0 0.02 parts per trillion, much lower than the median 11,000 parts per trillion found in the fish samples studied. If it's not safe in water, it's not going to be safe in fish. Nadia Barbo, lead researcher for the study and a graduate student at Duke University, says more testing and regulation is needed from public health officials. And we want states to make advisory levels for PFAS like they do with like mercury or like they do with dioxins or PCBs. Most states, including North Carolina, don't have consumption advisories for forever chemicals. According to researchers, the exposure from just one serving of freshwater fish equates to drinking contaminated water for an entire month something Wilmington resident Emily Donovan finds disturbing. The total sum of, um, of concentration was, was astounding, um, devastating, quite honestly. More research is needed to fully understand routes and harms of exposure to widespread forever chemical contamination. Liz McLaughlin, WREL News. And the study also found that fish caught near urban areas contained three times the amount of chemicals than those caught in non-urban areas.